And here's the situation. Let's assume that Gail and I named Dustin and Diana, our two children, to be the beneficiaries of our IRAs. Our children have three options as to how they're going to pay income tax on those IRAs. Remember, they can't roll it over. So that's the one thing. They cannot roll it over into an IRA, into their IRA. However, option number one is my son can take the money out in a lump sum. So let's assume that we're leaving our son a quarter of a million dollars in IRAs. He goes and says, I'm going to take out the quarter of a million. He reports a quarter of a million dollars worth of income, pays tax on it. And between the federal and the state with those higher brackets and with all the other Medi-Cal and Medicaid and all those types of the taxes now, 50% close. So out of my $250,000 I left to my son, right off the top, pretty close to a half of it is being wiped out, being paid to the government. 